Menstrual cycle. How it begins. What is its impact? In this video, we will discuss each point clearly. Watch the video till the end. Menstrual cycle, also called uterine or ovarian cycle, happening roughly every 21 to 35 days. Menstruation is the blood and tissue leaving a female body. Menstrual cycle has four main phases. First one is the menstrual phase. This is what most people commonly refer to as your period. It's day one of your cycle. During this time, if pregnancy hasn't occurred, the thickened endometrial lining of your uterus is shed. This phase lasts for five days. Hormone levels of estrogen and progesterone are low at this point. Let's explore the inside of the ovary. Ovary contains growing follicles, which contains immature eggs, and that starts the second phase called follicular phase. Your brain contains a pituitary gland located at its base. This gland releases a hormone called FSH. This hormone causes tiny sacs called follicles to grow inside your ovary. Each follicle contains an immature egg. One of these follicles will become the dominant one meaning its egg will mature. As the egg grows, the ovary produces estrogen. Estrogen thickens the uterine lining, preparing for pregnancy. Quick question. The estrogen and progesterone levels are low at which phase? At day 14, ovulation takes place. Luetinizing hormone triggers ovulation. Ovulation is when the mature egg is released from the dominant follicle in your ovary. The egg is only viable for about 12 to 24 hours after it's released. The egg then travels down the fallopian tube, where it waits to be fertilized by sperm. Interesting fact. Did you know that some women can actually feel ovulation? It's called Mittelschmerz. After ovulation, the ruptured follicle in your ovary transforms into corpus luteum. This is called the luteal phase. Corpus luteum starts producing a hormone called progesterone, which is essential for maintaining that thick uterine lining, just in case an egg gets fertilized and implant. If pregnancy does not occur, the corpus luteum breaks down, progesterone levels drop, and this drop signals the uterus to shed its lining, bringing us right back to day one of the menstrual phase. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video, and don't forget to subscribe.